The memory of a big man with a big heart was honored this morning in Butte. MTN's John Amy was at the funeral of Lee LaBrush that was attended by hundreds of mourners. Hundreds of people filled the cavernous St. Anne's Church in Butte to honor the life of the man affectionately known as the Big Kahuna. Lee LaBresh unexpectedly died at age 55 while battling influenza. As Butte's long-serving county coroner, those who worked with him remembered the empathy he showed while doing his job. Tremendous compassion for, for people that were going through a, a rough moment, uh, a rough uh, stretch uh, when they were dealing with the loss of someone and, and Lee was one of the most compassionate people that you'd ever meet. During the service, people remembered his professionalism during the dark days of his job and his fun-loving nature when he was off the clock. Not only did he care about the job and, and how it was done, done right, uh, he cared about the people that were left behind. Many students from Butte Central were at Thursday's ceremony to honor the man who was once the defensive coordinator for the Maroons and also a teacher at the school. It's no surprise so many people turned out on that snowy day to pay their respects to such a beloved member of the community. That's just a testament to what kind of guy Lee was. Uh, 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 he loved Butte, he loved Butte people, and, and uh, people loved him. Remembering the Big Kahuna. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Lee LaBrush is survived by his wife Kim and their daughter Alicia.